Hello guys, and welcome back to our tanks. Uh, today what I have for you is I have a tier 10 clan wars of Omni vs YU. Uh, it's a mountain pass which is often quite a defensive and campy map uh, if played badly. Uh, I really don't like this map because teams can just go full camp and defend the base. So pretty much the first thing you need to do on mountain pass is, well, like most maps, find out where the enemy team are. And that's pretty much exactly what I'm going to do in my badger. Uh, I'm going to go across to G5 and I'm going to spot uh, anything moving in this direction, this direction, but pretty much whatever I can spot. If they move anything quickly to the bridge or maybe a bat chat can just about sneak across before I spot it, but I should spot pretty much everything. Uh, now we do have an E3 that we can put quite defensively down the bridge uh, if needed. And we've got one bat chat going out this area. One batch had to spot the bridge, and I believe he's going to try and cross and do the boost. Um, and there's a batch had spotted. He takes a shot of damage, but he probably won't take much more. So pretty much, uh, we spot this 113, and I spot the crown wagon and take a shot. But these guys here are immediately getting spotted. Now they're playing really, really aggressively, and we need to find out whether it's just one of them or whether it's many. And well, it is many. Uh, they've sent a load of 113s straight across the bridge. So at this point, all we need to do is we need to make them push into a lot of our tanks. Um, we've got an E3 that's going to be difficult for them to kill. We've got some E5s, and we're going to move our 50Bs and 113s over there just to just catch all these guys. So far, we've only spotted the 113s. However, they could be pushing. They could have tanks in behind, and we're just going to like just take them out. That was a really bad shot by me. However, I do manage to get a shot in, but pretty much I'm just going to cross and join in with the fight myself. There's absolutely no point us trying to fight anything else at this point. Uh, our base is not a risk, obviously, we've got everything pretty much back. Uh, and we can just kill these guys without having to worry about anything else. They've got a crown wagon in base. Uh, they've got a batch out that was spotted over there. Um, they've probably got arty. Uh Basically, they've got tanks out of the battle, and as long as we just kill these guys quickly, we've got a huge overmatch and we just need to push in. I didn't bother loading, uh, maybe I did have time to load. I just wanted to make sure I had shells to put into the enemies here. So pretty much these guys are sniping the 50Bs, and you can see that there's this area here, that if we push forward to here, we can't get shot by their 50Bs. So we might as well keep as left as possible, some tanks can stay here, like the E3, though, they can take the shots. Um, and the E5, but any tanks without armor should really come over here and just put shots into the side. Uh, it gives us a lot more space just to pretty much just work these guys down. So these 50 Bs are a bit defensive, and all we have to do is just kill these 113s, and it's just over because we would have just taken so many hit points from them. I'm pretty sure that they didn't have to win this game, or well, it's going to be something like that. That was just so unbelievably aggressive that there's no way... I, I don't know whether it was a genuine attempt to win or not, to be honest. Or whether it was just uh, them trying to catch us off guard as we push tanks down here, push through, and win that way. I'm not really sure. I don't really know. However, from here, we just really get a farm. They did have a full team. So it can't have been a complete throw because otherwise they, unless they had too many people online, but I'm not really sure. Uh, they played aggressive, and we managed to catch them out by getting tanks into position to shoot them as they tried to push. That's pretty much all it is. Oh look at that auto aim, Reese would be a trip. I'm not sure. I hear the. Uh, the top of the engine, which is a bit unfortunate. However, we just need to push in, uh, kill the RT, kill the Crown Wagon. I save my one shell, just in case I manage to put a shot into RT. Uh, the Crown Wagon, you can see here, is opening himself up, and well, obviously it's over at this point. I've got the Oops camo today, because uh, I changed it while streaming, and it's pretty much stayed since then. So I'm desperate for this RT kill. I'm gonna push past uh, the other bad chat here and make sure it's mine. I'm so greedy. So 
this was a really, really quick game. Um, why you just pushed really aggressively with the 1 1 3s? They were probably attempting, they, they probably wanted us to push in with some tanks and kill them, or try and flank with some tanks and then get caught out while trying to flank with them. Uh, with their E150s and Vs there. However, I'm not completely sure. Uh, and they did just get ready for it. So, I thank you very much for watching. I hopefully you did enjoy this video. And hopefully I will see you next time. Goodbye.